All right, welcome back, guys. Sorry about that. I had the uh, camera quit on me for some reason. I don't know why. But well, you missed all of that. So, snap back, redo it all again. Reverse, straighten this out. Boom, boom. Double blaster. You know, got I repainted the the uh, bullets, and I painted some like nice gunfire going off gunfire. But I completely redid the entire hot rod. I went through the body mode, took the backpack off, and everything. That's out of there. But it can still go on in car mode, just peg everything back in. Did redid his feet, gave him some nice decent feet. Uh he's got two blasters. That way he's screen accurate. I gave him some more extra orange paint tech specs uh on the face as well. Went back through and did all that. And I went on the back and did some orange paint on the back side. Vehicle mode. Looks about almost the same. Did some gray shining gray dry brushing to the wheels that way they look actually decent and under if you look close enough you got the orange right here just in case because if you look at the figure itself it has everything like that that's the reason why i did that we did the forearms that nice paint got um double blasters double blasters I had to get another one just because of the esque feeling of it they didn't come with a second blaster so i had to do a second one but overall, I am very proud of this figure. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut out. I'm going to come right back. Alright, here we are. But uh, same thing, same-esque feeling. All I got to do is, uh, you know the transformation. If you watch the review and everything, you know this all this whole ordeal. Just flip those, grab these. Grab these arms. Push the chest up. Get the head out the way. Got to get that out. The, yep, like I said, get the head out the way. And then rotate everything. And voila, and then peg everything in. I rotate these arms. Where's the peg? At? There it is. Okay. Oh god, where are you going? Stop moving. There we go. Grab these wheels. Double hinge them because they need to be on that double hinge. And then voila, you got the you got route mode. Almost done. Okay, and then. These are just simple things. You just flip them in, flip the feet down, voila, voila, and then rotate in, peg, rotate in, peg. And there it is. You can see what I've done to them and what I haven't. So, head wise, this one looks a lot better, in my opinion. But yes, I went and got a second hot rod, second sound wave, and a second bumblebee. I made sure to grab two of the bumblebees because I really like that bumblebee-esque feeling. And I'm still working on the other one. I'm working on, what, five figures at once right now. So, but he is one of the complete projects. Because you can see on this one, this foot right here, you see his feet. Those are not like these. These are custom by me. Nobody else has done this so far because probably the only custom hot rod world war ii hot rod about to go out because nobody else has worked on him so i hope y'all enjoyed the figure i hope y'all enjoyed this um overall review of him and leave me a comment if you like what you like and i don't you can do it if you want i'm not gonna ask for it so if you like my content and everything go right ahead and get out of here because we're all good people <laughs> so but um yeah world war ii hot rod completed Thank you all. Have a good day.